Move that one over a little more. Don't do yeah, that. scoot this way, you guys. What are you going to do? Sit here. Sit here. Sit here. Sit here. Sit here. Excuse me. Sit here. Somebody sit here. All right. Good. Danny Tamarelli, <laughs> how you doing? <laughs> well, look at I'm Leon Farson. Who's that? Nick Cannon. Amanda Bynes. Christy Knowings. Mark Saul. Josh Server. Oh, we're so lucky. It's a I thank God every minute I can. Oh, yeah. It's a blessing. Kids rule. Every time, every yeah, time yeah, I watch our show, you know, thank you. Everybody. Right. Too many people, everybody, everybody talks. I know. Yeah, everybody <laughs> talks. Everybody <laughs> talks. Maybe you could talk the entire time. <laughs> Maybe you could ask. How about whoever has the microphone? There you go. So. Hey. Answer the man's question. Oh, what was the question? <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> um, next question. Would you guys ever be coming famous and your parents support you? Yes. I yes. Would. That's it. That's a uh, all around yes. Yes, all the time, always, just giving me that extra push of encouragement and stuff. And my parents are really cool because they drive me everywhere, like an hour every morning. Let me say something. My mom was my manager for nine years, and dad's coming around, and everybody, uh, everybody always gives us lots of support, especially family and friends. So I want to thank them personally. All right, next. Most definitely. important thing. I want to say that um, my brother gives me so much support, and I know it sounds funny because your parents give you the most support, but my twin has twin. been so supportive of me. He's the reason why I'm on all that. So I just want to thank him. I couldn't do it without my parents. <laughs> Like I said before, family is just the most important thing. It keeps you humble, keeps you focused, and they keep your mind straight. That's right, yeah. My, my oh, folks man. keep me grounded. <laughs> <laughs> Dan, what's the best show you've ever been on on Nickelodeon, and what's the worst Nickelodeon show you've ever been on? There's never been a worse show on Nickelodeon, ever. Never. No, the best show's got to be all that, because it's the most fun. Like, I've been, I've been most fortunate to do, like, the whole spectrum of if there is a spectrum of comedy, because Pete and Pete was just so dark and, and kind, of, kind of mono. And then you go from to uh, all that, and it's, it's like any bigger is still not enough, you know? I went to Branson, Missouri once and for Nick Picks something, and it was pretty bad. <laughs> That's just my only, my only venting. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Which cartoon, uh, my name is Josh Server, and um, which cartoon show? Uh, I have no idea. Danny, sorry, go ahead. Uh, Danny Tamborelli, and I would most likely want to be on uh, Ren and Stimpy, because that is the greatest cartoon ever. Uh, uh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm back here. <laughs> no, my name is Nick Cannon, and I probably... Probably the Rugrats, because I'm just like a big baby at heart, and I still have problems using the bathroom. <laughs> so, probably Rugrats. Um, I would probably um, be on like a... Uh... Oh yeah, my name's Leon Farson. And uh... Cat, cat, cat <laughs> dog. I would, yeah, cat dog, because I love animals, and I would like to... Be connected to someone 24-7, <laughs> all day, every day, and someone that I was completely opposite with. Okay. Okay. I think I would be, oh, this is Amanda Bynes, and I think I would be on Hey Arnold, because Hey Arnold has, like, a lot of friends, and I really like his room. His room is so cool. He has, like, a little remote control for his couch, and it comes out of the wall, and then he has, like, this Thank you.